hope you're doing great today this is santosh shetty here and in uh, this uh, video what we'll do is we'll create a vintage photo effect photo effect using canva as a design tool uh, i can do it in any, with any picture but i'm going to use my own picture so that you know that it's real and i'm not using some old picture to do this okay and i'm not doing this in photoshop photoshop i am going to take a lot of time if i have to do it i am going to do this in uh, canva because everything is readily available and i am going to show that now all right and uh, before we go uh, if you have not done this already make sure you hit the subscribe button and uh, also hit the like button if you like the video and uh, it will be it will be great all right here we are in the canva dashboard so we'll create a a portrait maybe okay let me do this i'll do a 1080 by 1080 that's going to be my uh, design canvas let me uh, start with this okay now on this i'm going to uh, move one of my pictures uh, which i have already uploaded i can add any picture i'm going to add something which is nice maybe something like this setting my jazz background looks okay all right so i'm going to i'm going to make this look like a vintage picture like uh, it will look like a picture uh, like a photo which was taken way way maybe in the 1940s or 50s and uh, i have scanned it and put it on maybe a design canvas all right so to do that it's very very easy to do it okay and everything is readily available you don't have to spend too much of time all you have to do is click select your picture go to edit image and under edit image you can go to a uh, dio tone okay click on see all you can pick whatever you want but uh, what i am going to do is i am going to pick something like maybe something like this sepia okay see it already looks old we are going to make it look even better okay now with this i can play around now i can go over here and reduce and increase the intensity if i want okay i am not going to touch any of that only the shadows i would like to uh change i would like to use maybe i can use black or dark gray maybe black or i think i'll use this black okay so we'll use black apply so it already looks old now i am going to uh, add an effect on it okay to do that uh, there are a couple of ways of doing it i can either do uh let me make a copy of this what if i mess up right so i'll keep one copy and see there are two copies here so on the first copy let me try something i'm going to use uh i was looking for crumpled yeah this one crumpled paper i was testing this yesterday with this one let's see if i have vintage paper graphics nothing here let me look for crumpled paper crumpled paper paper background maybe okay this one no So it gives me some uh, recommendations when I'm doing this. I want black, okay, because black is the one which is going to give that effect. If I use white, it's not going to do that. I'm going to choose maybe this one looks okay. Let me do this. Bring this to front. I'll make this as a background later. and now i can reduce the transparency like this okay i make it look like an old picture this is still not there yet 
not there yet i'm not very happy with the way it looks this looks like a picture which has a laminate on top of it right so will not it's okay but looks like a picture with a plastic laminate let me do this there's another way to do it you can look for photos and in, okay see i was searching for it yesterday so here there are some images just look for black 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 paper backgrounds yeah look for black paper backgrounds and you will find some nice looking images see something like this cool right check this out so let me detach this bring this to front keep it over here You see how nicely it snaps. This is the cool thing about camera. That's why it saves a lot of time when you're designing. Done. And now I'm going to reduce the transparency like that. And now it looks like a nice vintage photo. One with the laminate another one with this so there you are that is how you create a vintage a photo effect with any picture that you have so that's about it try this out and uh, let me know how it goes and if you want to show me uh, your creation just uh, uh, look for design clan group in uh, facebook and just send me an invite request i'll add you into the group and then you can share me your creations i'll have a look at it i'll be pretty happy that you were able to do it after watching this video okay do that and uh, if you are somebody who would want to learn canva then i have a link in the description i am um, also i have created a, a canva designing a mastery pack it has about two courses in one so check that out it will help you uh, master canva and you'll be able to design anything that you want okay so check that out as well and uh, that's about it if you like this video make sure you hit the like button and also uh, hit the subscribe button so that you don't miss out on uh, content like this in the future i create content around entrepreneurship marketing and designing all right so that's it for today thank you so much for watching i value your time this is santosh here have a wonderful day